What are the best shoes that you can buy to make the most profit in Sneaker Resale Simulator? Well, the answer changes quite often, so I present to you guys a brand new series, which I'm not even going to bother naming right now. I'm too lazy. But basically, what we're going to be doing is every month or so, like for a specific month, we're going to have a video to just talk about what the current best shoes to invest in or what are the best shoes to buy in the entire game. So guys, I present to you guys the top five best shoes to buy in sneaker resale simulator this is technically gonna be for september but it's not september yet so we just won't put it in the title next month we'll do that but <laughs> yeah you guys if you enjoyed this video subscribe and hit that bell all my social medias are linked down below and comment down below what kind of shoes you guys think would be the best to invest in right now but with that being said you guys let's go over my list of the top five best shoes first i actually want to bring up a pretty good game pass shoe and it's going to be the nike low chunky donkey this shoe is pretty interesting so it's a game pass shoe just like some of these other shoes here but the difference between this one and some of the other ones is that these tend to be actually higher in price so let's go to like a different pair of shoes like you can see this is a consistent 1.2 to 1.3 mil compare that to like the grinches which are honestly lower this is just like a spiked up a little bit but then went back down as you could see around 1.1 to 1.2 mil i would recommend buying these simply because you can find a good price on these for like 1.1 1.2 million because a lot of people do just associate this with the other game pass shoes that are cheaper so you can find this at a very very low price and coming in at number four i'm gonna say right now it's the freddy krueger dunks for the exact same reason you can see 1.5 1.4 1.3 you could probably find these at a fair price for like 1.1 to 1.2 and resell it to get like over hundred thousand dollars in profit definitely those two shoes being number five and four is a good idea another shoe coming in at number three i know this is fast but trust me you guys it's all for good reasons. Coming in at number three is going to be the low Dior's. We can also put the high Dior's here as well because these do also go up and down. But more so the lows. These have been doing really good recently. You can see coming into the month, month of September, it is going from a million dollars to 1.5, 1.7, 1.5, 1.3, 1.4. It's starting to become a little bit more consistent. And I think selling these pairs would be awesome right now because you can make some mad profit off of these. And you can buy these for like 1.1 million dollars from people so yeah those first three shoes they did go by pretty fast you guys the only reason why is because those are three game pass shoes that i think have managed to get out of the 1.1 to 1.2 million zone and i think that's awesome because a lot of people will still sell these for that price which means that if you buy them you can resell them for really good profit in my opinion and i think that's what's gonna make these shoes coming into the month of september really good and if you guys don't have a pair of those shoes i recommend you get a couple pairs of them if you have the money for it but try to buy it at the prices i mentioned the 1.1 to 1.2 mil maybe 1.3 million if the shoe you want to buy is pretty good in that area but you can see that those three game pass shoes are honestly a lot more superior than like these grinch and the reverse grinches simply because of the fact that these shoes in the mater crocs and the lightning queen crocs even the playstations those shoes just aren't like i think they're too common now right now since a lot of people like those shoes they're pretty popular i think because those shoes are so popular the price just isn't as high and that's why i would actually rather buy those game pass shoes the first three that i just mentioned but yeah you guys probably didn't expect me to put the first three up so fast i mean <laughs> trust me it's it's cool but i mean trust me it is kind of unexpected and there's other shoes that are kind of like this too that we can uh consider for an example these travises have been going up and down quite a bit i think the highs are a little bit better yeah the highs are slightly better but yeah those are my first three now let's talk about the final two i just wanted to add uh shoes on there that i think would be great investments if you're not exactly the richest yet but now let's talk about some other insane shoes that you can buy and these are shoes that you can make a lot of profit off of and stuff like that i want to talk about the nike merrick Curial Superfly 9 Pink. I definitely said that wrong. These shoes I don't actually have right now, but you can see they spiked up pretty fast. Seven days ago, 175, 155, 230, 224, 100 million dollar difference in the last week. I think that's incredible. If you have a pair of these, I do recommend you sell them. We'll see if they continue going up or down, but just be careful of the market and everything. 
I think these are going to be really good shoes coming into the month of September. So if you want to get your hands on these now, you could probably expect these to go up a little bit more. I'd expect it to maybe get closer to what, where the Air Mags are at. But you can see the Air Mags did fall. So just real quickly, this isn't going to be on the list. If you want to buy Air Mags for slightly cheaper, you can do it now and then sell it for like three ten million later. That actually would be a great investment right now. But yeah, now let's talk about what I think is the number one best shoe currently to buy. So coming in at number one, I did put a lot of thought into this because I genuinely do believe that this shoe coming into the next month of September is going to do really good. It's going to be the low bubbles, you guys. You can see in the last day, these went up to $12.5 million. Before, you could see it went up by 400000 And you could see it's a consistent growth. And as you can see, it went from 9 mil all the way to 12 mil in two weeks. I think coming into the month of September, this is the shoe that you should hold on to and buy right now because it does look like these are going to be going up quite a bit more. And if you buy them right now, you can probably get a fair price for like maybe 12 mil or 12.3 mil. If you can buy it for a lower price, that would be sick. But I think coming into the next month, you guys, these are going to be the shoes that you need to have. And I actually have a pair, I think. Yep, I do have a pair. I think coming into the next month, selling these would be a great idea coming into the month of September, simply because these shoes are absolutely going to dominate you guys. And you could tell based on the recent growth, and I do think there are enough people selling them to where you guys can probably negotiate and get a good price for it. But yeah, that is my number one pick for this video, you guys. You could see we didn't just pick Air Mags and stuff, you know, because these are shoes that not everyone's going to have. I did pick these uh, Nike ones right here because these are actually going up very consistently and i think in september they're going to go up a little bit more but yeah this is my list on the top five best shoes that you should be buying comment down below your guys opinion if you agree or disagree also comment down below shoes you guys think would be the best investment as well so other people watching the video can just go down to the comments and just read what you guys have to say but yeah guys thank you so much for watching subscribe and hit that bell thank you all for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace